Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to you. My name is Ken Tracy, and this is Coffee with Ken. It is Wednesday morning. Wednesday morning. It's March 1st. It's 5 16 a.m. Happy Wednesday. Mm. This is a little show that I've been doing for quite some time. It's a show about me talking, sharing some feelings, sharing a little bit what's going on inside my head. <laughs> Hopefully, it's not just going on inside my head. Hopefully, others are having thoughts, wondering about life, and things, and feelings, and emotions, and ups and downs, and highs and lows. I kind of think they are. So it's just me, nobody had watch. But I think we all go through stuff and, you know, wonder why and wonder about things and wonder if we're doing the right thing and what have you. But sometimes in life we want to take a break from all that wonder. And that's why this show is also about me uh, sharing my love of coffee. And with that in mind, I got a nice hot cup of coffee in front of me. And I'm so excited to take my first sip on this Wednesday morning, on this 1st of March. I hope wherever you are, whatever you're doing, you got a hot cup of coffee in front of you as well. Cheers to us. Oh, I tell you what, I might have revealed what I was going to have today in my show yesterday for those that were watching. I think you guys know what just happened. Holly got a little too involved in our show. She likes to wedge in between the table and uh, my phone and my computer and here she comes again <laughs> she wants to be the star of the show <laughs> she kind of in some ways is the star of the show I like to call it coffee with Ken but really it's coffee with Holly so <laughs> tell her but anyway uh, I'm drinking the cinnamon dolce again today and I'll tell you what, it's a wonderful cup of coffee. I mean, I think, who would have known? I mean, I guess who would have doubted? Holly, I'm talking about like the cinnamon dolce. <laughs> she doesn't respect the fine flavor of cinnamon mixed with my hot coffee. Let's have another sip. Mm. I'll tell you what. Wow, Holly, Holly. <laughs> she got some drops on her head. Maybe she wanted to taste it. Hmm, it's dangerous in here. <laughs> anyway, that's an amazing coffee. I might load up on a whole bunch of bags and drink that till pumpkin spice season. One more sip. Hmm. Anyway, how are you guys doing? <laughs> how you feeling? How'd you sleep? Oh, I slept so well. I slept so well. Woke up, I don't know, just before four. Then realized I didn't need to get out of bed for a little while, so I laid there, put on some mellow hypnotic music, and just kind of laid there in a semi-sleep, uh, semi-conscious, semi-awake, you know, joyous, totally peaceful, totally relaxing, totally calming, uh, I don't know, hour or so. I just felt so good. It's kind of th funny, as I was waking this morning, I kind of... I have two phases of my life right now in their work or rest. And it doesn't leave much time for play or fun or, um, and I think for me, that's kind of okay. Cause I'm enjoying what I do as far as work goes. And my work right now has two facets that my job at super target. And honestly, I enjoy it, the heck out of that. Just, you know, it's work, but again, it's work where I get to be friendly to, uh, I don't know. 500 people a day and chat with 500 different people a day and kind of see how they're doing and tell them how I'm doing and kind of make jokes about what we're both doing. And the other facets work on these videos. I put a lot of time and uh, effort into that and have a lot of fun doing that. And it's kind of a creative outlet for me. And, you know, when you edit the videos, these the lives I do and the add the words and the music and the what have you. You know, it gives me a chance to express myself or be silly. I did a <laughs> silly little mini video of me dancing on a covered bridge in Naperville yesterday that made me laugh. 
it's obviously still making me laugh and it feels real good. Uh, sandwiched in there, uh, is some holly time or holly walks or time with my kids. And, uh, yesterday I had Augie in the afternoon and that was real nice. And, uh, I don't know, we just kind of hung out. We walked all over Naperville and it was nice that the weather's getting a little bit warmer. At least it was warmer yesterday. Enabled us to get in the, or him to get in the stroller. I'm actually pushing the stroller. But I'll tell you what, if they invented a huge stroller that could fit me and have somebody push me around, I think it'd be pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> I need the exercise. But uh, anyway, had a great day and dropped him back off at his mom's and hung out with Eve for a little while. Got home, um, you know, honestly, worked on some videos for a little bit and went to bed early and just got a wonderful night's sleep. And here I am uh, ready to go today. And I'm looking forward to the day. Uh, looking forward to drinking my coffee. Looking forward to walking Holly, packing my lunch, going to work, working hard, being friendly. You know, getting home, walking Holly, and then resting. Uh, it's kind of a cycle, but it's a it's a nice cycle. So much of my life uh, as a realtor, uh, 17 years, the there was such a fine line between work and and partying or socializing. Uh, you never felt like you were fully committed to, uh, either. And it was kind of, for me, in a constant state of confusion. Wait, am I resting? Can I do nothing right now or should I be out telling people I'm a realtor or, um, you know, on the other hand, if I was having fun, you know, would I have to be wearing my real estate badge if I'm at a golf tournament or something like that going, hello, anyone out there need a realtor, anyone looking to move? So I don't think I was ever fully committed to work or rest or, or play. And I think that's a kind of tiring way to be, or at least it was for me. And I'm really enjoying uh, being 100% committed to work or rest. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Me talking about work and rest is boring to you. <laughs> That's what I wanted to talk about this morning. That and the cinnamon dolce. Mm. So we're into March already. It's Wednesday. As I have noted, uh... The days fly by, the weeks fly by, the moments fly by. Best we can do is capture the moment in the moment and enjoy what we're doing and enjoy who we're with or even if we're just with ourselves or most importantly, if we're just with ourselves. And I hope you do that today. I hope you have a one, had a wonderful night's sleep. Um, I hope you're looking forward to your day, be at work or be at rest or be at play. Uh, I hope you're feeling good. I hope you are loving yourself. I hope you are forgiving yourself. And as always, I hope to talk to you soon. Bye-bye.